Today we'll be walking through the setup for a Grundfos MLE motor for external set point influence and constant curve. This setting would be used if you were controlling the Grundfos MLE from an external SCADA source or 4 to 20 milliamp source. When you first power up the Grundfos MLE, it will prompt you right to the startup guide. Here we will select language, English units by pressing OK and then hitting the right arrow to scroll to the next menu. Here we will set up the date. So our first format is year, month, date. Next, we will set up the date by pressing OK, using our arrow to change each digit. Pressing OK again. And scrolling to the next screen that we will set up the clock. So you have a choice between 24 hour and 12 hour clock. Hitting the right arrow, we will now set the time of day. Hitting the right arrow, we will now go down to go to assisted pump setup. Selecting OK. This will prompt you through the settings and explain to you the arrow functions. We will press the right arrow. And we will scroll all the way down to constant curve. Press OK. Hit the right arrow. We will leave this section blank for now. Lastly, we will have a summary. Press OK. And press OK again. The assisted setup has successfully been carried out. So next we will dive further into our settings. So we will scroll over to settings and then down to analog inputs. Press OK. An analog input one setup. This analog input one is where we will land our 4 to 20 milliamp wires coming from our SCADA system or our PLC. We will go through each of these steps independently. So first we will do analog input one function. This we will change to external set point influence. Press OK. Hit the back button. Go down to analog input one measured parameter. This we will change to other parameter all the way at the bottom. Press OK. Hit the back button. Next, we will go to input units. Percent. That's perfect. Go back. Input one, electrical signal. Here we will select 4 to 20 because that's what our PLC or SCADA is feeding back to us. We're pressing OK. Hitting the back button. Analog input one, range. We will set this to 15%. 15% is the minimum speed allowed on the Grundfos MLE. Press OK. Go back and we will go down to analog input one, range maximum. We will change this to 100%. Pressing OK and hitting the back button. Our analog input one is now set up to receive the 4 to 20 milliamp signal from the PLC. We will go back and we will go to settings. We'll go down to control mode. Control mode, verify that we are still at constant curve. Use the back arrow to back out to the settings menu. And we will go down to set point influence. Pressing OK, we will click on external set point influence. We will set up the type of external set point function. This will be set to linear. Pressing OK, hit the back button. Back to the home screen. Using our arrows, we will scroll through our boxes here. To set point, pressing OK, and we can manually change the speed that we want this to start at. Pressing home. This concludes the video for the setup of external set point influence and constant curve in a Grundfos MLE motor.